In the last video, we used a 20 volt battery and converted it to 5 volt to power a Bluetooth receiver. In this video, we will be taking it one step further and making the speaker completely portable and powered by a 20 volt battery. <laughs> to do this morning we're gonna unhook our 5 volt speaker thing that we made and we're going to try to convert this 20 volt battery to 12 volt so it can run a Bluetooth adapter for a speaker with an amp, a mini amp in it. So we're going to try this, and that would actually make our speaker project completely portable. So let's dig into this. All right, let's dig into this. Let's hope that we can see everything. I'm hoping everybody can see everything except just my big fat belly. Um, anyhow, let's, uh, let's dig into this, um, let's get going, um, we're going to open up the converter first, and this is supposed to be a, either a 20 to 60 volt in, and 12 volt out, alright, so, that's what we're going to convert this battery to a 12 volt. All right, this amp, this mini amp, we're going to check this before we hook it up, though. Mini amp, we'll have to read the directions on it. So let's, let's set that to the side first, and let's get this hooked up. Um and see what we're getting out of this make sure we're getting um, we are getting 12 volts out of it before we hook it into all right and hook that um we're gonna use Need to make sure which side is what. The stripe side is plus. Alright, so in. It, I, I'm not sure if that caught anything. Um, I'll put the battery in. See if we get anything out of this. On bolts. I don't think we got. Yeah, we got 12 bolts, 12.3 bolts out of it. 12.3 bolts. Twelve point three. I'm sure what the dog's barking at. All right. I opened up this uh, this amp here, and looking at directions here, it looks like uh, I the heat sink. There's a heat sink on this. There's other things. Um, basically straightforward, uh, we would put a jumper on here for power supply that they include, or, right, so that, that plugs into the back of the board here, 12 volt, 3 amp. All right, so with that there let's go ahead and figure out exactly i assume 
it goes so we're gonna put we're gonna put it right here you see that I put that right there um, I really don't know from this picture I don't know that it what matters but that's where I'm putting it All right um, you have a right and left speaker going in here All right. <laughs> All right, we got this all put together. Nice and little pretty thing here. Um, you have your volume. I have your volume. And bass. And treble. I don't know if they're right or wrong. But they're on there. Alright, All right, so we got to hook the power in. We're going to use the white as positive. You can see here, just got to push it in there. And we're going to use, we're going to actually hook it up then to the speakers. Alright, got this wall wired in, got it plugged in there. Alright, it's showing power on to it. We are going to put up a speaker here and see if I can't see the Bluetooth on it. All right, we should have power. Should have power. Let's see if I can't see it on Bluetooth. All right, that's it. Let's see if I can't find a awesome song here. All right. That, that's actually with, that's all wireless. From the of it's all based off of this. Of the 20 volt battery. We got a volume on it. Alright. And this could go right on the speaker. And we can make a place for it. Right in the speaker. So, this right here with this, these few adapters here could be inside of there, and these speakers can run off of any 20 volt battery. Pretty cool. All right. What we had here is we had this wired through a converter. All right. And I don't know why I didn't think of this before, but we don't need this. Wired directly into a 20 volt. This takes up to 9 to 24 volt. It'll take, right? And at 20 volt, we're almost get we're getting almost full power out of this. Full, almost full power. So basically, 20 volts hooked directly in, directly into it. Um, sounds even better even. These, these all work. Bass, treble, it's all nice. So I think. I think the next thing will be I we may redesign this case um, and redo another one. Use the same components, incorporate this in there, everything. Then it'll be completely portable. But we also want to be able to bypass this to where it can be hooked into a nice amp to get because you're not going to get full power. Unless you spend a whole bunch of money on these wireless things. Um, so, anyhow, there's options. All right. So, for that, we won't even need the spin. Because this is like $12. This is like $12. You won't even need that. You won't even need that. And this right here, I used an old charger. 
but I'll probably buy, you can buy these pieces to where these batteries will slide right into. I'll probably do that for the other one. Um, I don't know. I have another one of these, so I may just do that too. I don't know. But anyhow, this is, this is fun stuff. Fun stuff. All right. Thank you for watching. And until next time, bye.